Hey guys, what's up? This is Nine Life Software. Today, I'll be showing you guys how to upload your apps onto the App Store. So first, I'm just gonna make a new project. Okay, so there it is. Now, before submitting, make sure you have an icon image. Um, you need to make it have an icon for your app. Okay. Icon. If you guys do not ha know how to do that, uh, just search on YouTube how to add icons to your apps. Okay. So I'm just getting all this guys, all this stuff set up. Okay, there we go. So first, we're gonna do is go to. Um, App your uh, Xcode project and do get info. Go to the build tab, and uh, we're gonna go to the con actually go to configurations. Now go click on the release and do duplicate, and then name this distribution. Okay. Now go to the build tab and do show. I'm oh, sorry. Go to configuration and do distribution. Now scroll down until you see. Until you see, um, oh yeah, any, actually, no, not, not right now. So, now we're going to go, uh, into Firefox. Oops. So, we're going to go to iTunes, connect. I know, actually, we, we need to do something before that. So, we're going to go to, uh, developer. That apple.com slash iPhone. Now you need to log in. Okay, now go down into iPhone develop iPhone developer program portal and click on that. And make sure you guys have uh, a registered account to Apple. It costs ninety nine dollars, okay? So go down to uh, provisioning, distribution, and you have to make a distribution provisioning file, okay? So um, I'll edit this one, modify it. So it has to have um, the profile name, you have to have a distribution certificate, app ID, and that's it. So you just do submit. Okay, I'm just gonna do cancel because I already have all that stuff done. So and then after it's done, just press Command R because it'll say pending, and then you can download it. So download, save file, save it to the desktop. And you also need to download the certificate. So go to the distribution tab, and then download. Save file. Save. Okay. And if you guys do not know how to make a certificate, certificate, just go to uh, Keychain Access. Go to the top of here and do Certificate Assistance, and then do Request a Certificate from a Certificate Authority, and then you just do User Email Address and all that stuff. Okay. And then it'll make you one. So after you download both of them, you have to double click on the certificate first, and then do keychain, lo keychain login and press OK. Now after that's done, do sample provisioning. Double click on this. And it, o it should open up, like, and it should open up the organizer. Oh. Okay. So after you do that. Go to distribution or whatever your I, um, Xcode project's name is. Go to get info. Go to any iPhone device and then do, and then make sure it's iPhone distribution right here. It says sample for application identifiers. iPhone device. One second, guys. Yeah, it should say iPhone develop, sorry, distribution. Currently matches 
iPhone distribution, your name, and then the app name. Okay? So click on that. Exit out. And now for simulator, you're going to do iPhone device 3.1.2 or whatever um, version you have and do distribution. Go to the build tab, clean all targets. Make sure these are both checked and press clean. So now you do command B or just build. Okay. Now you quit that. Go to the uh, your Xcode project. Go to the build tab. Go to distribution dash iPhone OS. And right here, just right click, compress. And you should have a distribution.zip or whatever your app's name is. Dot zip. Go back to Firefox and go to iTunes Connect that apple.com. Okay guys, I'm running out of time, so I'm gonna have to make a part two to this. So stay in tune.